kind of working it every which way on the tops of the rocks, kind of defining them. All this darker value, see the rocks are probably, you know, like a, a one or a two just above the zero, totally dark. They're probably a one, and then so this pane is probably a two or a three, but you can really, may not be able to tell it on the video, but it really makes this whole painting really stand out now that it's getting this really neat looking green that goes very well with the rest of the painting colors that I'm using. Your color scheme, four things I'm always constantly thinking about while I'm painting. Of course, the overall composition covers a lot because, and that can be so many different things for each painting because different things require different things where shapes are important or they're not important or are you symmetrical, not symmetrical. Um, so your overall composition, just how the thing looks overall. That's number one, but that can encompass many things as I've said. Then the next three are, are just general. They're no more important than each other because they're all important. And of course that's your value composition. Not so much the individual, but the overall, if you squint your eyes at the painting, how does it look value-wise? If it went and, and you put it in black and white, how would it look? Would it be interesting then? Okay, and then my third thing, of course, is my warm, cool composition. Uh, you have to, you're constantly battling to try not to make everything look cool. You know, cool colors, of course, are generally are your blues, greens, and violets, where your warm colors are yellow, orange, and red. And so, if you have a nice blend of those, I believe, in, in seascapes, because a lot of seascapes turn out to be too cool. So you need a blend of warmer colors in there somehow. And fourthly, I believe that color scheme, the whole, the, the, col the particular colors that you do use in your painting, how well do they go together? That's what brought me in, because these, this particular green, that yellow by itself would not go with this painting whatsoever, but mixed in and toned down with, with the burnt umber, then it looks just fine.